The good news for anti-plastics campaigners and for the ocean is that good business leaders are beginning to realize that sustainability makes business sense. Selfridges Group has stores in Canada, Holland, Ireland, as well as the UK. And when I speak with my own leaders and our partners, I use these seven reasons to try to change the way they think about how they run their companies. Firstly, and most importantly, do the right thing. There may be those in the audience who were surprised by this, but good leaders care about the impact their business has on the health of their planet. Beyond compliance, good companies are not afraid of legislation. As someone at Nike once said, sustainability is innovation misspelled. Protect supply. Good companies act to keep their supply chain healthy. Fishermen need fish, luxury goods providers need silkworms, and the travel industry needs clean beaches. And for us retailers, customers are still going to want hot and cold drinks. They're going to want their takeaways and their lipsticks, but they're not going to want to use single-use plastic packaging anymore. Sustainable growth. Good businesses hate waste. Plastics make your waste management process complicated, and you have to pay someone to sort your rubbish and take it away. Attract the best people. Good companies know that teams want to feel that their employer has a higher purpose. The talent landscape is incredibly competitive at the moment and good people want to go somewhere to work where that shares their values. Good companies give customers a safe place to shop. Customers want to trust us. They want us to give them choice at the very least and take a stand on the things they believe in. 66% of millennials say they'll pay more for sustainable products. And 82% of Selfridges customers said they believe environmental impact is important. They expect us to innovate. When you can search the net for anything you want, what is going to make you a loyal customer? Well, how about starting with what can you trust that you know where the product came from and that it's not going to have a detrimental impact on the world? Good businesses know that their reputation is hard won and easily lost. In this activist age, where more than ever before, customers' identity is linked with their principles, 